Well, look what the cat dragged in. Hamago-san? What's all this? Didn't I tell you? I'm decluttering. <laughs> I lugged all this out here by myself. Oh, I'm beat. I was hoping you big, strong men might do the rest. You buying new futons or something? Business must be good. Wait, there's no one here. Where are the girls? They all quit. What? I'm closing up shop. Huh? Uh, uh. Eugene Show Revitalization Shelter. It's a facility in Hamakita Park. Bleach Japan set it up. Girls from the industry and their families can live there free of charge. For free? Damn. And all your girls went there? Sure did. Why wouldn't they? The facility's offering job training and legal help with visas. No better place for girls like them who don't have citizenship. And Bleach Japan is behind this whole operation? Yeah, they're being useful for once. They're gonna open more just like it, too. And they even offered to buy my place and turn it into a shelter. But then what are you going to do? This place is your bread and butter, isn't it? Oh, they thought of that. They gave me a job at the shelter. I'm gonna be the dorm mother. Oh, it's good pay, and perfect for a feisty old gal like me. Gotta say, I'm coming around on these do-gooders. Come on, Hamako-san. Don't you remember what they put you through? Yeah, sure, they were annoying. Bunch of kids tramp it, hey. Now they're putting their money where their mouth. It wasn't just a bunch of whining. And apparently the shelters were Ryo Aoki's idea, I have to say. Not to be a downer, but don't you think he's basically just buying votes once the election is over? I bet you he's gonna forget. Yeah, seriously. But you don't know him. You can't just assume he's like that. Besides, you got some better option for my girls? Any spare rooms you'll let them live in? I'll have you know, Aoki-san came all the way out to a Jincho today. Wait, he's in town? He's attending Ogasawara-san's funeral. See? That shows he's a good guy. The guy who's got a million things on his plate, but still carves out time for a friend. You've got no business bad-mouthing him when you don't even know him. The young master. You gonna go see him? Yeah. With me too. Like what is connection to Horono? You guys are nuts. Well, what's your plan? Stroll up and demand- Oh, funerals are easy to sneak into. Everyone's too polite- Why are you supporting this lunacy? Sorry, Hamako-san. But do you mind if I... What's wrong with now? <laughs> Fine. Just don't leave... <laughs> so does anyone know where this... If it's any Jincho, it's gotta be at the Morgon Central. That's where Nonomiya's... Oh, yeah. All right. Kun. I remember the day we met. Nice. There's still time. 
Hey, let us through. We're here to pay our respects. Hey, are you with Bleach Japan? No, but we knew Ogasawara. Not good enough. The ceremony's just for family and Bleach Japan members. Well, maybe they'll let us light some incense. <laughs> they aren't even allowing journalists like me in. This monitor is all we get. Today, we celebrate Ogasawara-kun's memory. We do so here in Ijincho, the city of his heart and soul. You, more than anyone, yearn to see this city reborn. It was only six months ago that you came here with your family. And I remember how eager you were to change this town for the better. It became your passion in life. But one cannot truly care about a city until they become one of its people, which is why I was so moved when you chose to reside in Ijincho. There is no greater tragedy than the dreams we leave behind in death, and yours were bigger than most ever dared. I know this as your classmate in our youth, as your peer who shared your ambitions. But most of all, Simply as a friend, you left too soon. This is truly, truly a great loss. And so, what choice do we have but to face the future without you? We look to Kumekun, the protege to whom you entrusted so much. He has stepped forward to carry on your dream. And is there any greater honor than when, in our passing, Someone else picks up the torch where we left it. You and I always believed we could help people find their way together. Which is why, in the coming election, I will throw the entirety of my support behind Kume. I say this not as the Citizens' Liberal Party Chair, but for you, ogasawara -kun, as your friend who would see your dream come true. I swear to do everything in my power to bring your dream, Frijincho, to fruition. That is the least I can do for you, my old friend. Rest now and smile down on us from heaven. <sighs> We will just listen to this governor. He really cares. A strong man given If a... Aoki really did order Ogasawara's death... Bastard's grooming Kume for political office. What the hell is his plan? Hey. Let's move. Seats is the Citizens Liberal Party targeting this cycle. Any comment? Alkison, should we take your statement today as a campaign launch announcement? Any comment at all? Just a soundbite, Alkison. Clear the way. What's your motive for holding a new election? Hey, don't push. I said don't push. All right, folks, let him through. Let him through. Alki. Hey, Governor Alki. Ah, that's no good. Can't even get close. Let's head him off. How? It's not like the governor took a train here. He's got to have a car nearby. Sure, but how are you going to find it? Check every parking spot? You know, I once read in some tabloid that celebrities park underground to avoid the paparazzi. Aoki probably uses the same... Yeah, that's a thinny underground lots around here? Yeah, there's a big one. It's in... Great! But...
Do 
Copy that. We'll be ready to move out right away. Start the car. The governor's en route. Bingo. You were right on the money, Sachan. Do this. Stop! Identify yourselves! What are you doing here? Chill out, fellas. Just not a chance. Get Code Red, we got trespassers! Mr. Governor! Trespassers? Don't make us some. Sub... Who are you? We're fans of the governor. We just not right now. Please? Come on. You can't. You'll just take a second. The governor ain't got time. Take a walk, Jack. Take a walk, Jack? <laughs> you from Kansai? You got a problem with that? Well, it means you're Omi. <sighs> I don't hear you denying it. Wow, a governor employing Yakuza as his bodyguards. Unreal. Shut up! I'm a civilian working security! Speaking Kansai don't automatically make so. Oh, you're angry I assume something? You assume- Because that's what you are! Whoa, whoa, whoa. Why don't you do yourself a favor? If not, we'll have to- Freeze! Whoa, easy. That's quite the weapon you got there. I was only gonna ask for a light, man. <laughs> Why's a local security guard packing something like that, anyway? Asshole, I'm about to shoot you just because you're annoyed. Did the safety on? Huh? <clears throat> gotcha, fucking rookie. <laughs> you think I'm playing, you dried up sack? They wanna fight? Let's give them a bloodbath! You do it. Bring it on. Alright. Let's go. Yeah. Yeah. Just gonna stand there. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
What have you done? Uh, Mr. Governor. Can't you tell the difference between thugs and law-abiding citizens? What's wrong with you? Uh, I'm sorry, sir. We are terribly sorry about this. Do you need medical attention? I never thought I'd see the day when my own guards hurt a citizen. I'm just glad I saw the scuffle in the rearview mirror. Please, let me help you up. Sir. Young master. Tonight, go to Orohime Land alone. I'll do the same. It's such a relief that none of you were hurt. Please accept my sincere apologies for all of this. I'd also like to apologize on behalf of my guards. I'll be giving them a strict lecture later. But for now, I must ask that you excuse me. I'm late for an appointment. Listen. Yeah. Hmm. <laughs> hey. No. Hold on. Uh, yo. Okay.
just had a great time. See you. Appreciate your time. I was wondering if anyone would show up. I didn't expect it to be you. <laughs> I'll drink whenever the hell- and Don't forget, I was a regular- <laughs> Oh, is that how you want to play it? Okay, well, if we're doing that, <laughs> and this whole school- <laughs> Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you know, when we're out drinking like this, it's hard- Everyone's the same once you strip off- Rich, poor, leader, follower- I guess, but you can always- That's just because of the- Yeah, uh, but then- My point is, you can't- It's not like we were born with- All jokes aside, there's this whole idea of being next in line just because you're the boss. Yeah, can't choose who your parents are. Not everybody's cut out to run again. And I'm sure somebody else would have stepped up if you had stepped down. I don't know if I was a good fit or not, but I was a pretty sharp kid back then. <laughs> and I don't remember losing any fights, either. I Sounds like you were pretty- I just didn't give a flying fuck, that's all. Real ma- Up until I swapped places with my old man, we were all- But after their boss, Lao Ka Long, bit the big one, the E Jean 3 got their stalemate going. Your arrival's from Chinatown. Are you talking about the Snake Flower Triad? Yeah, they pulled out of Japan a long time ago. Oh, so you became the leader of the Yokohama Lumong after the Snake Flower Triad was out of the picture. Just about. Had to have been almost ten years ago. Hmm. Ogi Kubo let me in on the whole counterfeit. Also told me about how the stalemate... Man, still can't... The only people in the Lumong that knew about that. The new boys kept saying they wanted to move in and take over. Hmm. <sighs> then, it was no ambition this, and we got- <laughs> Haven't seen this side of you before, Zhao. You're real- uh, It's not like I gotta worry about the gang anymore. So I'll get his drunk- Hell no, it's not. I was just- huh? Well, maybe I have shown too much of my hand. Oh, really? I hope I didn't kill- Nah, I know you're the kind of guy that just said- Yeah, sure. Let's get enough- <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yo, Jungi Han. If you're here drinking by yourself, that's so. Well? By the way, Kasuga-san, hmm? I was contacted by someone in the Komijuru. They seem to have learned that Jungi Han is somewhere- No fooling. No, we don't have much to go on at the moment. That said, if they come- You and the others may be dragged- You know I don't mind getting dragged- That's precisely why- Don't be stupid. What's a friend- I welcome it with open arms, in fact. Such enthusiasm. I can't say I'm so. Any guesses? Though? I can't be 100% certain, but. Jingo Mafia? It's hard to say. To them, I'm. Perhaps they see that as unforgivable. Punished? It's possible they'd go. Then couldn't we just avoid all this shit by saying you're not. Maybe. It's gonna be weird being another person forever. If I were you, I'd. Hmm. A name is one thing. Moreover, I'm still waiting for more information. Well, on... it's your call. But won't it be a drag if you get caught with your pants down and your... <laughs> right. Man, you're always playing it so fucking cool. I'd ask that you refrain from praise. It wasn't a day.
で行かれますかそれでは Hey. Hey. Listen. Young master. You were born in a dump much like this one, weren't you? It's been a while, young master. I figured you'd want to see me. I know what you want to ask. Why did I change my name? Why am I a politician? Why did I help destroy the Tojo clan? And, are you curious about my lack of a wheelchair these days? You actually willing to explain any of it? I am. My condition was cured in America. I got a lung transplant. Did you know that if you drop a stack of cash into the right palm over there, you can buy an organ? Incredible. But even with deep pockets, nothing is simple for the son of a Yakuza boss. That why you changed your name? Yes. I did it because I was born the son of Masumi Arakawa. And because my condition robbed me of the youth everyone else got to have. I was happy to change my name and start a new life separate from all of that. <laughs> and look at the results. I'm not only the governor, but also the chair of the ruling party. <sighs> What's wrong? You can't bring yourself to congratulate me? Not from the heart, no. Are you even happy as a politician? Politics is a good life. Unlike the Yakuza, you don't have to use violence to assert control. I can improve people's lives, and they're grateful to me for it. You think Ogasawara's is grateful? You killed him. <laughs> oh, that. That was just a sensible precaution. Man, listen to yourself. <laughs> Come on. After you kidnapped him, he ran his mouth about Bleach Japan, did he not? He was never much for discretion. He swore to me that he didn't tell you anything, of course. But I could see the truth in his eyes. That sealed his fate. So... <laughs> You just kill people over an assumption? Without even bothering to check? I'm checking now. Did he tell you the secrets of Bleach Japan or not? Well, that's... I mean... See? Proper risk management is all about mitigating threats before they... But he was your buddy! He helped you start Bleach Japan! Being at the top means you have to know when people are no longer... relevant. Like father, like son, right? My father looked after you for years, but when he had to, he cut you from the family. That's not how it went down. He asked me to go to prison to keep the whole Arakawa family safe. You think that's why? Captain Sawashiro killed some guy who reported directly to the Tojo clan. If we had let Sawashiro get arrested, the Arakawa family would have had to own up to it, since they were lower on the ladder. 
Oh, Kasuga. Whether you went to prison or not, Sawashiro wasn't going to be arrested. You don't know that. Oh, but I do. Because Sawashiro didn't kill that guy in the first place. What? As I recall, that night was the last time I saw you. Yeah, that club in Kamurocho we went to. On New Year's Eve. Yeah. It was your girlfriend's birthday. Right. I've certainly had better nights. What? Young Master! How long have you been there? Um... Young Master? So... Did you finish your business? I'm heading back. Use this to pay the bill. If there's anything left, might as well use it to wipe your ass. Get up! You can't sleep here, you fucking drunk! Come on, move your ass! Uh, f fuck off, man. This building's my family's property. So clear out. Go on, go! <sighs> Yakuza. That means you're garbage. What you say? Don't touch me! You're a power to turf now, fool! In this town, let me go! Fear the Yakuza! I don't know what backwoods village you might be from, but you're about to learn about Kamurocho the hard way, motherfucker! <laughs> you think you're hot shit cause you know how to hold a gun? Where'd you buy that thing, huh? Your local toy shop? Huh? You want me to pull the trigger, you son of a bitch? Do it if it's even a real gun. Go on. Do it! <laughs> Come on! Fucking do it if you've got the balls! Can't do it, huh? That what the girls say about you too? <sighs> Little bitch like you ought to know better. Now, you're dead! <clears throat> Dumbass. Do it if you're gonna! <laughs> I'm 
So is Shiro. I, I fucked up. I killed the guy. You were the one who killed Suzumori? Yes. I told Sawashiro what I did, then went home. Lucky for me, there were no witnesses. So I didn't go in Sawashiro's place. I went in your place. <laughs> That's right. Dad sold you to the law to protect his only son. <sighs> Obviously, he couldn't just tell you how it really happened. That's why he lied that you were taking the fall for Sawashiro. You swallowed the bait whole, and happily marched yourself to the station. So tell me, do you still trust the old asshole? <sighs> <laughs> I can only imagine how you must feel. Doing 18 years of hard time would have been bad enough. But then there was the other event. After giving him such a huge portion of your life, you finally see him and... Bang. Right? <clears throat> Must feel horrible even now. I'm counting on you, Ichi. Well, say something, Ichi. It doesn't matter what you say. I trust Arakawa-san. <laughs> then answer one question for me. Why are you in Ichincho? Couldn't tell you. Maybe because I'm Ichi Bad Kasuga. The guy who hits rock bottom but always crawls back up. I see. Even after all these years, somehow you've managed to stay just as dumb. It's kind of touching. Nostalgic, even. I can't even bring myself to be mad. What an honor. You know, I thought this meeting was gonna be a setup. But you came alone, like you promised. So I guess I'm touched, too. What? You thought I'd have you killed? No. There's no sense in squishing an ant. I'll let you live. We do go way back, after all. But I do have one condition. Don't ever come near me or Dad again. Understand? Well, I've got my own condition. Pull out of Yijin Show and get Kume to end his campaign. <laughs> Pardon? I may not be cut out for politics, but Kume sure as hell ain't either. Actually, the Citizens' Liberal Party agrees with you. Kume is ignorant and inexperienced. If he didn't have our support, he'd lose for sure. Then why are you having him run? <laughs> so everyone can see my value. Uh, what? Think about it. If Kume wins, how will the Citizens' Liberal Party react? They'd realize that an endorsement from Rio Aoki can turn entire elections even in favor of a simpleton. It will be crystal clear that I have the skill and influence to replace Ogikumo. They'll watch and learn. So, Kume's just a tool to you. An election is nothing more than a game of strategy. Are these Ijinjo revitalization shelters part of your game too? Oh, those. <laughs> those are the most useful tools of all. With them, I can round up all the illegal residents at once. Wait, what? I thought the shelters were helping people get visas. <laughs> Don't be absurd. The people going to them would never qualify for visas. The shelters will bus them to the Immigration Bureau, where they'll be deported. For real? 
You're lying to them right to their faces? I'm not lying. The shelter's purpose is there in its name. It's revitalizing Ijincho by cleansing it of criminals. Just give me an answer. Are you going to accept my conditions or not? Absolutely not. Well... Then I guess there's no chance of us finding common ground. Did you actually think I'd come here tonight because I wanted to negotiate? Remember what I said earlier. The only reason you're still alive is because I took pity on you. If I stop pitying you, you don't have much left. What the hell is this? I thought the young master said he would come alone. That makes you a fool for believing him when he said it. And for rejecting his offer. <sighs> Guess I'm kind of old-fashioned that way. I tend to take people at their word. Alone means alone. This way, Ichiban! <laughs> Go! Hey! <laughs> Guys, why are you here? Just get out of the damn way! Let's go! I told you it was a trap. Listen to me next time! The infield missed a few grounders. Time to call up the reserves. Let's give Captain Sawashiro a show. Break through him! Right. Gotta hold it together. You're gonna get stuck. Right, Check this out! Boy, wait. <laughs> You're in right. it now! Okay, fix it up. This ah. I love you! Oh. <laughs> I'm, oh, I'm not backing down. I'm oh, not right. Have fun with this. Yeah. 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 
Leveling up the world. Sweet! Isn't this all a little much just to take me out? Come on! Maybe it is. But then again, you did survive being shot. So taking precautions makes sense. So this here's the guy who took a bullet from the cat. Thought you'd have some meat on ya. But you're kinda scrawny, ain't ya? <laughs> Don't get cocky. Make sure he dies here. In that case, how about we draw and quarter him? <laughs> No way he pulls out of that one, eh? <laughs> Do what you must. <laughs> Ever seen a tuna carving? Get ready for the human version. When I'm done, I'll put his head- Just do it right. You leaving? Scared? No. I just don't want any of your blood on my suit. So you're still the type to leave all the dirty work to your peons. Guess after all these years, you didn't learn shit from Arakawa-san. You never shut up about the boss. I've always hated that. Let him say what he wants, boss. <laughs> Poor little shit only has a couple of minutes to live. No, that's enough talk. Kill him already. <laughs> Let's start the dissection! The old battle's on! Cool. Yeah, Check this oh, out! Get it. serious. I'm over here! Right. You're in it now! Try this on the side! I love you guys! Alright! <laughs> yeah. I'm not bad on I got this! Yeah. What a fight! I knew. Genki mama yare. You're in it now. I'm over here. Are you done with all the fun and games yet? You're gonna get stomped. Yep, to me guy. Just gonna stand there? Who wants to go? Let's go! I'm not backing down. Ore, ore. Watch this! Yeah. 
I am beyond pissed right now! I'm good to go. Better? Right. Check this out! Come on! This is my Okay. Get 
Begging for mercy now. Watch this. Just gonna stand there? Are you done with all the funny games yet? Yeah. Come on. You're gonna get it. Yeah. Let's see. Who wants to go? I'm not backing down. Take it. I agree. Weak. Right. You're in it now. Hmm. Heads up. Yeah. Here we go. Yeah. Get Are you done with all the fun and games yet? You wanna fight I got this? Here. Huh. Now we're You're talking. gonna be in a world of hurt. You like it, he's done it. Let's go! Here. On it. Get serious. I'm not backing down. Down! <laughs> cool. Yeah? I'm over here! Come on. Huh? Right. I am the lucky to stand with this. Just I got this. Who wants Try to this on the side? We're in this together, guys. No begging for mercy now. Have fun with this. Let's see. You can win. 
Are you done with yeah. all the fun and games yet? Who's this? Thank you. I'm I'm over here. Uh, this is the worst. You're gonna be in a world of hurt. Have fun with this. Ooh, I got ah. this. You want to fight? I'm not backing down. Come on now. Got some hit for you. Time to shine. Let's go. Yeah. This ought to help. Yeah. Here we go. Try this on your side. Wait. Give it your all, everyone. I'm ready Thanks, now. Yo. Thanks. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Let's Check see. this out. I'm going for the castle on you. There we go. Hell yeah. Strong. I did it. I'll take it. Weren't you saying you were gonna put my head in a box and ship it to the captain? I'm sure he'll be surprised to see your head in there then. That guy was really gross. Are all Omi Alliance dudes like that? They're the biggest Yakuza group in the country. I'm sure they have even crazier guys. And that's what's flooding into Ijincho? Great! Ichiban! Hamako-san? Is something wrong? I was just at the shelter. The shelter? I was taking something to one of the girls. She forgot it at my place. But... But they were all gone. None of the staff would tell me where they went. I don't know what's going on. Calm down, Hamako-san. Please, help me find them. Hey, I'm really, really sorry. But they aren't in Japan anymore. What? The shelter was just a trap for mass deportations. No! Those girls, they don't have anyone to help them in the countries they came from. That's why they came to a Jincho in the first place. I just want to... I just want us to give them a chance. How did this happen? Oh, no! No, 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 no! Oh, my son. If only I hadn't told them to go to the shelter. If only I'd realized sooner. It's not your fault. You did what you thought was best for them. He's right. Don't blame yourself. You were on their side until the end. <laughs> I'm so sorry. <laughs> God damn it. I told Hamako-san to get some rest. Thanks, Sacha. Ijincho, remember what Jungi Han said? We should basically get out of here while maybe we should consider that. You wanna run? I mean, isn't the situation kinda ho hopeless, huh? Well, you got a plan. Oh, not off the top. How about you, Adachi-san? Nope. I don't even have family to stay with. My parents died a long time ago. Psycho? I mean, I could leave, but I would never abandon my sister or my father like that. Sounds like we've settled that. Settled what? That none of us can run away in the same boat as the Komi Jewel and the Lisa. So our only option is to fight. And personally, I say there is hope. How? How it is... It doesn't matter. A long time ago, Ari, if you go into a fight thinking you got a chance... Uh, what the hell? 
Not gonna lie, that sounds kinda stupid. Hell no. A real fight's when our enemies are the Omi a lot. The crime lords from below are teaming up with the. We're going up against too much for you, Adachi san. <laughs> Don't be stupid. I couldn't ask for it. Can we include Tokyo PD in that lop? Hell yeah. Good enough for me. You guys are ridiculous. You know it's. <laughs> Tell me about it. Admit it. You like that about us. Yeah. What is my damage? Nanma, Sachan, join us and. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You can skip the pep talk. <laughs> you sure, Namba? Your brother's okay now, and he's getting married. Yeah, I know I've been a bud. But if my friends are gonna facades, it'll make for a great speech at my brother's wedding. Settles it. Let's knock him up. <laughs>